prepare for the enemy to fall into his own trap. Hello, it's great to see you back on Living Hope Channel. Today, we are going to pray a strong and powerful prayer to drive away the visible and hidden enemies that are disturbing your life. Let's ask the Almighty Father and His Divine Angels to drive these people out of our lives and transform them into better people. Let us ask for all evil spells done against you and your family to be nullified as well as all storms and strong winds that may be affecting your home or your family and friends. Participate in this prayer with an open heart and great faith to attract positive energies and God's blessing to fulfill our request. Find a nice quiet place in your home to focus on the prayer and put all your strength into it. This prayer is powerful for your life. If you are experiencing problems or feel discouraged, remember that these difficulties are not always bad. They are necessary for your growth and are the mechanism God uses to manifest His power and glory in the lives of those who need Him. Focus and put all your faith in this prayer, repeating it more than once so that it becomes stronger and stronger in your life and in the life of your family. Attract energies that strengthen this prayer more and more, so that it reaches our Divine Father. I believe and have faith that this prayer will transform your life. Let's start the prayer. Prayer for the enemy to fall into his own trap. Open wounds. Sacred heart, all love and kindness. The blood of our Lord Jesus Christ in my body is poured out today and always. The injustices committed by an evil man are a trap. He is caught in the net of his own sin. He who seeks good is respected, but he who seeks evil will fall victim to evil. As glaze covers a clay pot, so false words cover an evil heart. The hypocrite who hates hides his hatred behind flattery. He may talk a good game, but don't believe what he says, because his heart is full of hate. He may disguise it, but everyone will eventually see his wickedness. Whoever sets a trap for others ends up falling into it. Whoever rolls a stone will be crushed by it. I will go about clothed and armed with the weapons of St. George so that my enemies, having feet, may not reach me. Having hands, they shall not touch me. Having eyes, they shall not see me and neither shall they have thoughts to harm me. Firearms, my body shall not reach. Knives and spears will break without reaching my body. Ropes and chains shall break without my body being bound. Let their way be dark and slippery when the angel of the Lord pursues them, for they have laid a trap for me for no reason. They have dug a deep pit to catch me, but when they least expect it, destruction will come. They will be caught in their own traps, they will fall into them and be destroyed. Then I will rejoice because of what the Lord God has done. I will be happy because he has saved me from death. With all my heart I will tell him, there is no one like you, O Lord. You protect the weak when they are attacked by the strong, and deliver the poor and needy from the hands of exploiters. Jesus Christ protect me, defend me with the power of your divine grace. And may the Virgin of Nazareth cover me with her sacred and divine mantle, protecting me in all my pains and afflictions. God, with your divine mercy and great power, be my defender against the malice and persecution of my enemies. O oh, glorious Saint George, in the name of God, in the name of the Virgin of Nazareth and in the name of the phalanx of the Divine Holy Spirit, extend to me your shield and your mighty weapons, defending me with your strength and your greatness from the power of my carnal and spiritual enemies, and from all their evil influences, and that under the paws of your faithful horsemen, my enemies may be humble and obedient to you, without daring to have even a glance that could harm me. So be it with the power of God, Jesus, and the phalanx of the Divine Holy Spirit. Amen. At the end of the prayer, you can leave in the comments the following phrase, The enemy will have no strength, for God is the one who guards me. Now, you can repeat the Our Father prayer three times to strengthen and make this prayer more powerful in your life. The Lord's Prayer is one of the most well-known and recited prayers in the world, and is a way to connect with God and ask for protection, forgiveness, and guidance. 
It is important to remember that faith and belief are personal and everyone has their own way of connecting with the divine. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I am sure this prayer can help you. If you liked it, please leave your like on the video to show YouTube that this kind of content is important to you and help us bring you more prayers like this. Also, subscribe to the channel and activate the bell to receive notifications when a new video is released. Don't forget to leave your prayers in the comments of the video. Thank you.